Normally in a situation like that, where you're experiencing any type of mechanical failure, but especially loss of steerage or loss of propulsion, um, you're going to notify the local uh, Coast Guard traffic. So you're going to get on designated radio channel. You're going to say, hey, this is what I'm experiencing. Keep an eye on me. Um, I would imagine they did that because it sounded like on some of the articles I read, they had already notified local police and local police had cleared traffic from the bridge. They didn't have a ton of time to do it. They only had a couple minutes. Um, but you got to think if they notify the Coast Guard, then Coast Guard notified local authorities, local authorities dispatch. You know, the reality is there's a, a huge delay between those two things. Um, so you can imagine that they did do all their proper, you know, due diligence and notify Coast Guard, say, hey, we're experiencing issues. Um, they ran, went into their emergency procedures, probably fired up the next generator. Um, and that generator failed from, you know, poor maintenance or whatever the case is, just mechanical failures, they happen, especially on the water, they happen a lot. Um, and I think that's what you see is, you know, you see lights go on and off. Um, and then I believe they had a, uh, a quote from the Pilots Association in there in uh, Maryland, and they were quoted saying it was, a, you know, full blackout on the vessel, which is, you know, vessel dead in the water. They, they have no control over anything. They tried to drop an anchor, mm -hmm. but you drop an anchor on something that weighs 95,000 gross tonnage, um, it's not going to do anything. I mean, you, you might as well drop a shoestring. <laughs> so, so even though, you know, the anchors are, are built for um, that specific ship size, potentially uh, carrying loads and things like that, even dropping anchor won't slow it down or bring it to a stop? Well, an anchor is not designed to slow down. Uh, anchor is designed to hold a vessel in place that's already stopped, to mooring. Um, so, you know, a lot of times, even with that, if you have strong tides or current, or whatever the case is, you'll still see ships drag anchor. And that's from a dead stop, they'll start dragging an anchor. So if you put that and it's already moving at like five or six knots, you're not doing anything with an anchor. Um, but it's very surprising. It would be very surprising to me if it doesn't come out reported that there was severe damage um, to the anchor base from them dropping it and trying to drag it.